Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Virgo. This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of August. Okay, this is for the month of August, so we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for Virgo for the month of August? Keep in mind, this is being recorded in July. So, this is a preview for August, all right? I have to say that because we get a lot of people don't, they watch it in July and they're like, oh, it's not happening now. Well, this reading's for August. And the timing is fluid, so keep that in mind. I mean, it could be happening now because the timing is fluid, but, you know, and then again, not every reading is for you. So, hmm. Let's just see what comes up. This is for August 2020 for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What do we have? What do we have? Ha! The lovers. So this is harmony. This is the lovers. This is love. This is commitment. This is happiness. This is a soulmate. You, you must have a soulmate that is near or close. Um, you may be talking to this person or you're going to be very, very soon. This is a perfect union. It is a contract. This is a healing love. There's a sexual connection. There's this somebody that you have shared values with. It's like, uh, this is somebody that you have a very deep, deep, deep connection with. Okay, it's like you you know this is the person you know that, and they know too. You both know when you look at each other, you know there's no denying the connection. This is a real, true love connection. Okay, so this is uh, beautiful. You may be some of you may be um, just meeting this person, or you could be becoming engaged and promising to be with this person. This is, could be a promise. It feels like it's, um, it's just a perfect match, whatever it is. This is, this is absolutely a perfect match. Um, could be dealing with a Gemini, don't have to be. Uh, but the lovers is also a choice. Maybe you're falling in love with somebody. You're deepening a connection or the connection has deepened. What do we have for Virgo? You will be touching this person this month. Month There will be some touch. I guess we got to take them. Virgo. Ooh. That's not good. Club. Someone will try to make you do something against your will. <laughs> That's not good. Hammock. Taking a vacation physically or mentally. So maybe you're going to be taking a vacation, Virgo. Teardrops. Great personal sorrow. Now, this is a choice. Okay? This is a choice. So, so it hurts sometimes to follow your heart. You know, and this is a choice, a choice is a choice between two, okay? When you have to make a choice, there's two paths, there's two options, okay? So you got two options here. So there's some sort of sorrow that comes along with making that choice. So you are probably, maybe you have to, you know, choose, you know, um, maybe somebody is trying to get you to stay with them. You know, and you don't want to. This is passion. This is love. You know, so there's there's something going on here. Um, but anyway, so this is great personal sorrow over the choice that you need to make. Claw, be careful. Do not take risks. Now, I don't like to give that message because I think that's where you've been, right? That's where you've been. You have been in a space where you were afraid to take risk, right? Right? career and maybe you're where you're at because of your career maybe you're focusing on your career your career is going to be um, accentuated at some point during this month throne position of authority so you are going to be in a position of authority you're going to have to make a choice 
I think you've been very careful because you're afraid to make a risk. Maybe it'll affect your career. Maybe it'll affect your money, your income if you take this risk. You know, it's going to affect your career in some way. This is a big risk. Um, somebody's tr probably trying to get you not to do it. And it hurts you to not follow your heart. But I do feel like you're going to be taking some sort of vacation from whatever this is. So what do we got for Virgo? Maybe you're going to go visit somebody. Or they're going to come visit you. Ah, Five of Cups Reverse. Now this is focusing on the future. You've probably missed an opportunity for love, but now perhaps you're ready for it. There could be a reunion here between two people. Maybe there's been a separation. Maybe it's been about three years or two years or something like that. This has been going on. There could be some sort of reunion. Um... But this could also be an opportunity for new love. This is definitely love. Okay, it's definitely love. Um, nine of Cups reversed. Somebody's been really, really, really unhappy. They've been in an unhappy situation where their wishes weren't being fulfilled. But it was very comfortable. Very, very comfortable there. This is taking action. Act now. Think later. This is take action. Okay, take action. Don't don't waste any more time. Stop thinking about it. Just do it. Get moving. So you are probably going to be making a move. You're moving away from sadness. You're moving away from dissatisfaction. And you're headed towards a beautiful union here. Um... This is passion. This is excitement. You're probably going to find yourself very, very excited. You might even get really excited. You know, once you turn your back on this unhappy situation. This is moving in a new direction towards love. Okay, so you're headed towards love. And it's not something that you even have to think about. You don't have to think about it because it's so there. It's just like it's it's... It's, there's no question about it. There's no question about it. This is perfect. It's a, it's a perfect union. There's, there's no questioning it. There's no need to question it. It's the truth. It's the whole truth. Okay. This is accepting the truth, seeing the truth, uh, seeing clearly. Communication. You're going to be communicating with somebody that you know is perfect for you. Um, this is awakening and it's, it's an epiphany. Um, needing to take action. You are going to take action or somebody's going to be taking action towards you. The Knight of Wands moves very, very fast. Uh, this is the sort of communication. It's speaking the truth. After being unhappy. Two of Wands. This is your choice that we talked about. So this is being at that crossroads. Do I stay or do I go? You know? You know, it's it's making that choice, making that choice to honor your truth. So you will be honoring your truth or somebody that you're dealing with is going to be honoring theirs. OK, there's some deep, deep, deep feelings here and there's there's not there's no denying it. So I think that we have an individual that is making a decision and it could be a very spur of the moment decision with these two, with all these three cards. It could be a very spur of the moment decision where somebody just. Uh, decide they decide to communicate or they decide to make a move somebody is making a very and I think it's a bold move I do it has to do with uh, a partnership that is meant to be it's it's undeniable this is partnership this is partnership somebody is making this is a choice that is a choice somebody is making a choice based on the truth okay they're being honest with themselves that's why they're taking action so there's there's action that is going to be taken um, the decision is being made. Ooh, it's time. 
this is the temperance comes after an ending. Somebody has been trying to stop you from leaving or stop you from following your heart. But I feel like you you've come to the point where you've you've evolved. Okay, you're seeing exactly clearly what this is. I feel like you're definitely taking a journey as well. Whether you're traveling or somebody's traveling to you, there's a journey here. I think you've waited and waited and waited for the moment, and the moment is now. I feel as though you're you're ready to allow and accept change, even if it hurts. And I think it does hurt because. You're letting you're letting somebody down by by going in whatever direction this is, but I think that you know that this is part of your purpose. This is a purpose, okay? This is reason. There's a reason. I think that you've come to grips with the fact that everything happens for a reason. There's a time and season for everything, you know, and it's a, and you've changed. You've changed, and I think you're going to be coming together with somebody that uh, you can blend with very well. You do blend with very well. This is somebody that you know, um, you just know. You just know that they are the one. Um, I feel like uh, it's been a long time though. I think it's been a long time. It's, 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 this is, there's definitely going to be a, a reunion here. It is a soulmate type of thing. Um, you may be, you may just start communicating with this person this month, or you may, I feel like you're going to be touching this person. You know, you're going to, I don't know why. I just feel like there's going to be hands like that hands coming together where you're, you're touching this person. Um, some physical touch. I, f I feel like there's going to be some physical touch. Anyhow, um, you know, you, I think that you are understanding that, that everything is fluid and everything changes. And I, I think that's where you're at in your life. So I feel like uh, this month is going to be a month of change where you move in another direction very, very fast because the Knight of Rods moves quickly. Um, somebody may be coming towards you very quickly. Um, there is going to be direct communication and coming together. Okay, you're coming together with this person. Okay, and you may be deepening a bond. You are. That's what I feel like this is. I feel like you're deepening a bond with somebody. Um, yeah, you're going to be working, working together with someone. There's teamwork. There's mutual respect. There's there's togetherness, there's communication, there's there's appreciation. You got you just appreciate each other. It's easy. It's an easy union. It's an easy partnership. So this month you are um, you're gonna be coming together with somebody that you know. I think that it's very exciting. This is like a new partner. Okay, it's a new sexual partner, or it's a new love, or. It's it's a reunion with somebody that you are very familiar with. It's like you. This is a soulmate. This is a real, real, real soulmate. This is like a past life connection kind of thing. I think that uh, there's uh, this is exciting. It's a very exciting time. I think that there's opportunity for growth. I think you will be going. You are going through a period of growth right now. Um, I think you you are about to leave something very dissatisfying behind and you're moving into a very exciting period with another person um, where there's a lot of uh, ease. It's very easy. There's, there's just, uh, it's, uh, there's a lot, there's a magnetic attraction as well I mean there's a there's a deep sexual connection here and um it's it's more than that though you know it's it's just a very easy uh, partnership where you don't even have to you can completely be yourself you can be yourself in every aspect of the word self you don't have to pretend to be anybody um you just you just you see things the same way, you know, it's like, this is your, your, uh, perfect match. Anyhow, um, somebody is choosing, they're making the choice this month. Oh, look at that. Ten of cups. They're seeing clearly with the set. They're seeing clearly what, what, where they want to go. Okay. They're seeing clearly that, that, uh, what their, but their best option is before they were confused. 
They had multiple options. They didn't know what to choose. Now they're, they're making the choice. So the choice is being made to go after happiness. Okay. There is definitely going to be a union, a, a, a love union here. Okay. So you're going to be falling in love or deepening a connection with someone that uh, there may have been some abandonment in the past or there was, you know, a separation, but now you're coming together with this person. Um, yeah, so that is what I see. I don't feel like I need to go any further other than, you know, I think that uh, it is that birthday month for some of you in August. So happy birthday if it is. Somebody is seeing clearly what they want there's there there's it's it's like there's, it's the end it's the end of confusion it is we have the ace of swords down there that's seen clearly as well i think you're going to be communicating with somebody that you uh uh mingle with very very well put it that way That's what I got. Good luck.